What's up, real world? Twisted luck. Hope everybody's good. Thanks for being here. I appreciate all of you. Hope everybody is well. We have amazing, awesome weather in Florida right now. So hopefully everybody else. I know on the West Coast you're dealing with like or dealt with or some bomb cyclone again. Very strange weather things we've been seeing recently, huh? All over the country. Very, very strange. You almost hard to believe that could be natural, right? But that's crazy talk. Anything else would be crazy talk. So hopefully everybody is doing good. It's pretty awesome here in Florida. I mentioned before, we had a beach day the other day. And then, you know, after that, we had like a beautiful park day because it was cool out and it got cold. You know, having fires and making s'mores. So it's all back and forth, but it's nice and we can do fun stuff. So strange things, strange weather, strange things. Um, not so much the weather, although we've talked plenty about that because I've seen so many strange things and experienced so many strange things and recent weeks here in Florida and many others have commented also in Florida seeing some of the strange things I've been seeing uh, recently so and it doesn't matter where you are Florida anywhere um, you are seeing weird things but a couple other things I wanted to bring up so uh, on the highway the other day and during the day there was, and this is actually a stretch of highway that is in some of the purple streetlight videos that you've seen that I've done. Um, some of the footage where I'm driving down the highway and it's just nothing but like a purple tunnel of lights on both sides of the highway. In one of those stretches from those videos, but during the day I noticed there's a brand new strange tower there right in the middle of all of that stuff. Uh, and it, it's I don't know how it's very new like it could be a couple weeks I don't know I don't know how exactly how old I don't know when it was put up but it's very new and uh, that's what that looks like um, we all know what what that is but I thought the placement of it mm, could could be a little bit odd with everything else that we've seen around it I had to go back and get a little bit of video of it um, but this is a little bit different than the other five uh, type towers we've seen before uh, this one's shorter it's just i've not seen one like this before it seems a little bit different i don't know if it's just a new style or maybe serve some sort of different purpose but that was odd now there's something else i've mentioned a couple times um i'm on my way to it now i'm hoping i can go film this thing um it's a sunday and i'm hoping people won't be out there i went out there once before and i got chased out it's a construction site a lot of people have asked me about this and because it's this big giant building huge massive building being built as it was going up it looked like a prison was being constructed just this massive prison its location is odd for what they say it is and maybe it is maybe it isn't but it seems odd to me uh, the land over there is very expensive it's very near the highway it's also very near a, a mass of uh, another mass of purple street lights. It's very, very close to that. Um, but they claim, now this is in Florida, and they claim this building is, a, is being built by a heavy equipment company out of uh, Ohio, I believe it was. Um, and it's just going to be used to store heavy equipment. Now, when they first started clearing land, people thought they were going to, like, park dump trucks in the land or whatever. Thought it was just, like, this big, you know, empty land because they cleared out so much of it. But then they started constructing this big building. Now they're clearing out even more land next to it, so I'm not sure exactly what it is. But it seems odd to me that a, a heavy equipment company out of Ohio would be spending... Uh, surely, this is costing so much money. And specifically, the land there. Um, it's right across from a Amazon uh, distribution center too so the land there is pretty pricey and this is a, a building where they're just going to store what I don't know tractors in there heavy equipment I don't I have no idea but it seems odd and it's raised a lot a lot of suspicions and a lot a lot of people and a lot a lot of people have asked me about it and uh, I've been wanting to go I've gotten little bits of video here and there as it's gone up, but uh, 
it's it's kind of hard. I have to try to get better better video when nobody's there, um, and there's almost always people there. Otherwise, it's it's mainly just driving by. But I want to put this out there because some other people mentioned some other things about some big, strange buildings in different areas of the country that have raised their suspicions too. So uh, this very well could be, for some reason, some company out of Ohio wanted to spend a lot, a lot of money to uh, store their heavy equipment in a very expensive building on very expensive land. But the thing is massive. You'll see it in a minute. It's just absolutely massive. So uh, I'm, I'm gonna hopefully show it to you now. If not, well, we'll, we'll get to it when we get to it. And I'll show you uh, some little clips of video too that I saw uh, that I've gotten uh, in previous months when I've come out here uh, to look at it and try to go out there and get better video. I'm hoping it works out today. So we'll cut to that in just a second. Check it out. Let me know what you think. Maybe you're familiar with things like this. I don't know. But again, the placement right at the highway around all the other things, the timing with everything else these days, you know, who knows. But uh, so we'll check it out and we will let me know what you think about it. So this clip here was taken months back. This is pretty early on. All this that you're seeing, all this land is land that belongs to this place. And the construction was pretty early. You'll start seeing that here in a second. But you can see just the size of it. That this thing is going to be absolutely massive. This is when it started getting people's attention and people started talking about it. Asking what the hell this thing could possibly be. Because it, it looked pretty prisony, and uh, it's just so big. And we'll go past it here, and you see how far it goes back. And we're starting, to, this is the side of it, coming up on the back side of it now. This is when I was just driving by, getting video of it. Here it is sometime later, a little bit further along during the construction just showing it in stages it's really hard to get in there to get decent video because there's always people in there I do get in there though you'll see and here it is again the same angle this is weeks later I went by and drove by this thing every once in a while just to show progress and just to see what's going on start to see what it's looking like see if by some chance there's some signs up saying what's coming soon but still nothing but here we go this is the first time I went in there I tried to go in there uh, just kind of into the entranceway just to get a closer look and I started getting that closer look it was pretty quick that they spotted me and uh, didn't want me there but I wanted to get as close of a look as I could before that happened, and I thought that might happen, and it happened pretty quick. You'll see uh, the truck racing up to me here momentarily. But this is when this thing just started really looking ominous to me, like, what could this be? I don't know, it just had a very prison-like look, I thought, and a lot of people agreed. Now I just spotted that truck coming. So I'm starting to plan my out here um it's coming i jumped back in the truck to try to get out first but they came up pretty quick here so uh they kind of beat me to it but that was all right no big deal i got a little bit of video as i drove out to just a little bit more just to catch anything else that i could possibly catch uh, as i <laughs> took my time and uh and pulling out here but so those of you who have seen things in other areas, does this look similar to what you're seeing? Are they done yet? What did they end up being? So we're going to drive out. But I come back uh, a little bit further along. You'll see in this next clip, and a lot more of it is complete now. That whole front section is, is, is on. You'll start seeing it in the next clip. This is why I didn't really want to screw around in there, because it is posted, and I was beyond the sign. But just innocent. Just a citizen observing, right? So here we come again. This is the most recent time. I'm just capturing a little bit of video of the back and the side, the same shots you've been seeing and driving by. But uh, this time, 
I'm gonna go right on inside. This is when I this is on a Sunday. I thought nobody would be here. Um, and look, you can see how much more is done. Still, just looks to me so ominous. And you'll see a couple of vehicles over here. And I was like, don't. I didn't think anybody would be there. But the vehicles are here somewhere. Unless they're there, there they are. Two vehicles over there on a Sunday. Still somebody there anyway. So I just took a couple minutes here just to slowly scan the whole thing. You can skip forward if you want. It's mostly just, you know, here this. Come. Uh, of course, these trucks now started up right away as soon as I got there, just like last time. So I kind of thought that they were going to uh, come to me. Always coming out this but I didn't realize this all the way, that last big opening there on the right side of the building. See, I wanted to try to go before they could even get my tag. So I stopped filming over there. And what I didn't realize is those vehicles went into the building in that bay over there on the right. Um, but I, I didn't film it. I, he's about to turn left. I don't capture it on video, though. That last big bay. Both vehicles drive in there. Now, I thought that was kind of weird, too. Why, as soon as I get there, did they, I don't know, go into the building? I thought that was kind of weird. I thought they were going to come to me. But for whatever reason, as soon as I started filming them, they got in, started it up, and put it inside the building. So that was a little suspect to me that I just happened to have the right perfect timing. I showed up here right before they were going to do that anyway. They weren't even in the vehicles yet. But as soon as I start filming, they decide, hey, let's take this inside. I don't know. I thought it was a little bit odd. Share your thoughts. Let me know what you think. But to me, a little bit odd. You know, could have had ironic timing, but over these past two years, no irony. See, all this land here, this is all part of it. I don't know if more structures are going up over here or what, but this is just massive. I mean, I guess it doesn't represent as well on video as it does in person, but, I mean, you can judge from the size of the equipment in those vehicles how massive, massive this building and this big plot of land are. Now, right here, that bay that you see, just about in the middle of the screen right there, that's where they drove into the building. And I'm going to show you where that Amazon distribution center is right here. So, you know, it's placed right across, directly across the street from Amazon distribution center. And like I said, I don't know how much more is going up on this plot of land, but they've cleared out a whole lot more than they originally had cleared. And just, I don't know, it seems strange to me. All this, just to put heavy equipment in it, from Ohio? Maybe it's normal. What do I know? I tried checking on that bay to see if they might drive back out, or people might come out, but they didn't. Not as long as I was there, anyway. And that's just a sign for the construction company. No, no coming soon or anything. So there it is. And apparently there's no day that there's no people there. Now I thought those trucks that, if they were, that was like seconds after I got there and started recording. Uh, they started up, started driving. I, I thought both or one of them would be coming for me because that's kind of what happened last time. So I stopped recording to go back to the truck real quick. Um, because I wanted to move it. I was going to come back, but I wanted to move it so they couldn't even get the tag number. Um, but they ended up driving into the building. I wish I had just stayed recording. They drove into that last big bay. Then I couldn't see them, not with my eyes anywhere. Maybe it shows up on the camera. I don't know, but they drove into that building. So, like I said, this is not just weird to me, but lots of people have mentioned this, and there's lots of mystery surrounding it. I've not been able to find anything on it in my searches other than when it first started, there was some little blurb in some like local hometown paper or something, which said this, this company out of Ohio was storing heavy equipment there. So, and then some other people, I, I've mentioned this before, I mentioned I was gonna show it to you. And in mentioning that some people have said, have asked questions like, where is this building? Is it close to any major highways and things like that? And yes, it is. So if that has anything to do with anything, I don't know. And like I said, other people have mentioned 
seeing similar things uh, popping up in other states too. So, you know, I'm not saying it is something. I'm saying, you know, uh, that I'm always just observant and I, I look into things and I don't, uh, you know, I don't see in the news, just like the purple lights where they told us, oh, just a mistake, don't worry about it. Uh, you know, they say, oh, heavy equipment company gonna store things there, don't worry about it. I don't just move along and be satisfied with that answer. I'm curious. It's more curious to me that why can't I find anything about it? Usually they'll have signs out front, you know, coming soon, this is what it's gonna be. There's nothing like that there. It's just the construction company that's that's building, which I think is like Conklin or something like that. Just remembering by memory. Um, but I don't know. So, I mean, it, it could be something where legitimately just some storage company or some heavy equipment company, construction company, whatever it is, wants to build a giant building across the country to store their stuff. I don't know, but the proximity, the value of the land, if it's just for that, here's my thing. If it's just to store equipment like that, wouldn't you want, you know, probably find cheaper land somewhere, not very high priced land because of its location, Amazon distribution center right next door. Um, I don't know. I don't know. It seems to me, it just seems odd. I'm not saying it de definitely is nefarious, you know, but it, it definitely seems odd. And I know a lot of people agree because a lot of people are always asking, hey, did you find anything out yet? Did you find anything out yet? Um, so now I'm gonna share it with you. And I'm curious if any of you are seeing similar things, you know, like this or have any ideas. Maybe this is played out. Maybe you know exactly what this is. But this is, you know, how we figure things out. We come together. When we see strange things, we come together and we figure it out. Like I said, the timing of it is odd. The placement of it is odd and just with everything else. You know, does it seem like that's gonna store heavy equipment? I mean, I guess it could store a lot of things, but it definitely was very, very prison-like looking um, in, in the beginning. And I took some other videos of this too over time, but I have a hard time finding them. Um, I've been here and there, when I go into that area, I've gotten little bits of video, mainly just driving by. There's always people everywhere. Um, and yeah, it's, it's definitely looked like some sort of huge prison compound or something like that, which obviously is disturbing in the times that we're in and, uh, many things that are rumored and speculated and things like that. And you know, what, what the future may or may not bring. So anyway, share your thoughts. Let me know what you think of this damn thing. Let me know if you're seeing anything like this. Um, and you know, we'll see what we see. I don't know, it's strange. I'll, I'll update you on it. I'll, I'll go by there again sometime later and see, you know, what it's looking like. I don't know when it's supposed to be complete. And you saw like over to the left of that building too, now they've cleared out all that land over there also. So I don't, I, I don't know if more is going up right there and that massive giant structure isn't all of it yet. I don't know, but we'll find out and I'll let you know. Share your thoughts. Thanks for being here. I appreciate you. Twist of Luck Truth. I'll see you soon.